Every time when we use terms such as sustainability agriculture, we have to really define what we mean. So in that context, I think a list of principles uh, that are not to be applied rigidly, but better explain what is the concept, the approach, the emphasis, is extremely useful. And I think for an organization like CICE, this is quite important to be able to articulate that in, a, in the form of a set of principles that are not binding, but actually chart a territory uh, a direction of travel and that is particularly important. The more people can understand what's behind a concept, the clearer that's made to them, uh, the easier it is to build alliances and the easier it is to keep uh, saboteurs or um, interest groups um, who would have different views as to what should happen away from, from that. You know, it, it, draws, it draws useful lines but at the same time it offers opportunity for inclusion because people can see, wow, it's not just about science, it's also about practice, about social movements. It's not just about ecology, it's about social justice. Um, it's not just about um, good farming, it's about cuisine and local patrimony, uh, good food, conviviality, etc. So these are very important magnets that will draw people into conversations that can take agroecology further in theory and in practice.